Hello, this is Snowfrog, and we're gonna be playing Masters of Magic. It's a nice old classical game. You might know Civilization and so from the old good old days, but this game is with magic. We're just gonna take a normal difficulty in this round. Four opponents. There can only be one, two, three, four. Land size, making it large. The magic weak, normal. We want powerful magic. In this here screen, we could be choosing between different pre-made um, ma uh, magics or wizards. Um, but I think we would actually be starting with playing the Jafar. I was actually thinking about making a custom one. Where you can see here, I can just choose a name and the character. And then I could choose my own skill book, uh, magic books, and also my specialties. But we're not gonna do that. We're gonna just pick the Jafar because he's got the alchemy, which I will explain later. And in this one, we're just gonna play with blue magic books. Um, I'm thinking about taking the race of High Elves because they have some um, very cool troops later on and then we're just gonna pick the Golden Flag so we're gonna start the game Wooddale hmm yeah okay we will we elves so this is our city it's a hamlet of Wooddale. Like in Civilization you can choose what to build. We would like to build a granary in the beginning here so we can get more food and more people per turn. You see here we get tw uh, the 70 people per turn and population is 4000. This is our fortress. 8 turns for a granary. But the different thing is in here we have spells. We have a magic spirit. We'd like to make one of those in the beginning, just to explore with. But it's also the ones we need later on, if we want to get more magic out of gnomes. Another thing is our mirror. Here you can see the elf uh, alchemy. So we're changing uh, mana to gold in a ratio of one to one, instead of only uh, one to and a half. One, one for a half and gives us all the units in city's magic weapons. So that was when we went in here and uh, see if I can find it. The, nope, it was uh, their magic alchemy. Yeah, we're trading one to one both ways of gold to magic. We don't have any magic at the, at the gold at the moment, so we can't trade that. Here we can set the skill we don't have that many spell points at the moment. We have a casting skill wind in combat of 20. But we want a bit more mana just in the beginning now. To cast the little spell we just placed. Then we got research like you do in normal civilization and so on. Where you're just going to choose to have guardian wind. It's cheap and uh, so we'll get a next spell quicker. Uh, it will take a few turns to get our magic spirit. And there it comes. We've summoned a magic spirit. Then we can go out exploring with this. Oh! We got our granary. And I think we want... what do we want? Um, Forest quest. We've got quite a few forest grass around us. We've also got mines. Um, um, okay, we'll build. Um, uh, it's taking a bit long. What is a sawmill? I think it's yeah. We'll take a sawmill so we can get more production out of these squares for building faster later on. As you can see here, our population just increased by 30. So that's good. 
and we'll keep on exploring. Oh, there's a city. It's got two units in it, spearmen and a swordsman. We could actually try and take it, shall we? Let's do it. Now we're in combat, then we can cast our spells. Oh, we only have to one phantom warrior. We'll just let it wait here and move. This is a bit different than in Civilization and so on, but... We're hoping to win this combat. It actually doesn't look like it. <laughs> so we lost our... <laughs> at the beginning of the game, we lost our first troop. But we could build another one. And we'll just make a few turns. And that we got we could take our is this our swordsman? And then we've got uh, we've got the higher spearmen. We let the spearmen stay in the town and then we'll go for this town. As you see here we have an upkeep of uh, our magic spirit. He costs one mana a turn, so that's actually why it's so low. Which reminds me of uh, our magic here. We need to put a bit more in research. We don't need that much. And maybe a bit more in skill, like that. Let's try and attack again. Oh, they just got reinforced. But we can build two Phantom Warriors now. We'll just stay back. We can only cast one spell a turn. There shouldn't be a problem in this combat. And we're waiting. Okay, let's see here. We'll try and not lose our troops. Uh, okay. And try and move him back. And... There you go. And then we got our second, uh, second city. We just killed a few thousand <laughs> populations, but... We can put this to the uh, populations, making it grow a little bit bigger. Very fast. Or we could build a builder's hall, which we need to... Uh, build our granary, city walls, and so on. But I'm just gonna put it at housing at the moment, and take the next turn. Then I'm gonna make this swordsman patrol here, and keep on exploring with our magic spirit. Oh, there's some ruins right here next to us. We found some ruins. Let's see what we get. Oh, we find 50 gold. That's okay, that's cheap. <laughs> okay, this is our first node. You can see here, this is a Chaos node. Scouts have spotted a fire elemental inside within the Chaos node. Do we wish to answer? No, I know we can't. We can't win over a fire one. Fire elemental. So, but if I take now and press F1, I can look. It's a Chaos node, and it's got a fire elemental inside. So later I can see what's inside. Um, just a comparison. Oh. We got a new spell! Yeah. We like flight at a later time, summon hero and phantom beast. But let's do the spell magic. If I check, press F1 here, it's unexplored. And then the here it's hill. And it's got productions and so on. Bonuses. So. Oh, it's empty also. We're a bit lucky on those. Oh, and there you go. And the wood bale population has grown. Okay, there's zombies. The problem is, there can be anywhere from 1 to 9, I think it is, zombies. So, and 
it, uh, if it said something larger, like a wraith or something, there could also be zombies. There's probably also skeletons in this because it only shows the um, the, uh, the hardest of the um, what's called creatures, which in, uh, which is inside. So we'll just wait a bit and see. And the lizard caves. Okay. Then we can try the builder's hall. Now it's only 15 turns. We could buy it, but don't think we want to spend our money yet. And we can go up here. And there's also skeletons. Oh, there's skeletons in it. Let's try this one. Okay. In this one, there was oh, actually only one. So it shouldn't be a problem. Especially with our phantom warriors. I'm trying to make it so our magic spirit is not uh, going into combat. Yep, another 50 crystals. Over here you can see it's damaged. Uh, there it is, melt with a node. If we complete the ones like these, there's all uh, one in each spell category, I think. No, there's not one in uh, light and not in uh, dark magic. Uh, but otherwise, we'll get some uh, extra mana each turn for melting. Oh, there's actually another. There you can see, there's another wizard. And we can do everything, exchange spells and so on. But, and if I left click here, you see she's pure green and she's got nature magic. Okay, this means we can't exchange spells because I'm not allowed to get her spells and she's not allowed to get my spells. Okay, we keep finding gold at the moment. And I th actually think we need to be building some uh, troops just to um, make sure she's not going to attack. Okay, she was going to attack. So we need to try and defend ourselves. She's got spearmen and I think... Uh, we could try and dispel this one because it's a magical creature but we could also try and see how good the these phantom warriors actually are against the troops they actually seem pretty good so we can just make more phantom warriors Uh, just wait. It looks like we can win with our Phantom Warriors alone. And attack! So, well, as you see, she's still neutral. So it's not like we're at war. But we're not at peace either. There are giant spiders inside this one. Okay, let's see. And we got it. Our sawmill. So, now there's the forester skill. More harvesting food and production. But I actually think we need to be thinking a bit more about troops. Maybe we should actually just build a few swordsmen. Mm, yeah. Let's build a few swordsmen, just to make sure. And there it is, our Nagas is summoned. Um, I think we're gonna make it patrol here at the moment, because if I lose this city, we are gonna get banished. Because this is where our fortress is. We haven't lost the game, we can then cast a spell of return. So it's not that big of a problem, but I need to have another city ready for us to cast it. Uh, 
and that's not <laughs> something we'll have at the moment. We have this mod, but uh, I don't think it's actually big enough for casting the spell of return for it. Oops, and as you see, you can actually just press the button and then it would move by itself. Maybe build another spirit so we can. I could just make it go over here and explore. Yay! The summon circle spell is just as you. S oh, that wasn't correct. Um, was if the ah uh, stop doing that. See where is it? It's behind there. Summoning circle. So that's where the creature will be summoned. I could move this for another city later on, if I uh, want to have uh, it closer to my enemy when I'm at going to attack or something like that. Let's see what is the special here? We've got a lot. Okay, we want the granary here now, so we can get a bigger city quick and. There was the other player. Oh, I just wanted to stop this. Here you can see, in this game, there is something different. This is a green node for green spells. This is a tower. So, we are actually just going to make this one go in here next turn. And there is another one here. This is a nightshade. So if I build my city on, on top of this, uh, that can't be cast any uh, enemy spells on it. So, let's see next turn what monsters are in these places. Unicorns. What these towers does is, if I press here, there's actually two planes. If I win in this one and clear the tower, you can go from one plane to another through these And let's see here. There's war bears in here. We don't want to be fighting war bears at the moment. Oh, fifty mana crystals. I want you to go over here. Did I actually send a troop? Yeah, I did. Okay, you can explore this way. Okay, there's raiders here, so you can go home. Okay, there's skeletons, let's try. That shouldn't be any problem. Ah, uh, let's just... I would rather stop fighting with the magic spirit at the moment so that it won't get killed there we go and inside we find another 50 gold okay this is zombies okay let's try I see there's two troops in this one They have a bit more strength, as you see, which is the sword. Okay, it doesn't look like we can actually handle these. But let's see, maybe we can. I didn't take too much of a damage. Okay, we'll try and flee. The forces has retreated. If I've lost any troops, it would be standing down here. So I actually succeeded in retreating. Let's try and move the nuggets. I could actually just put this to auto combat. And I actually lost a troop. I didn't think I would lose any troops uh, in that attack, but I did. <laughs> 
and the raiders will keep coming. Okay, there's another note here. There is a chimera in here. We really don't want to fight these. The troops I'm we have here is uh, not very. Um, they aren't very good, so it's very normal that we can't do that much with them. So, okay, we want an armory. Twenty turns. That's long. Hmm. We could also get the library to get more spell research. How long does this... Okay, we, we'll build a few swordsmen. And then let's see what's going to happen. We can build two more troops. Uh, maybe we should actually stop this one and build a settler. So we can build another town. And you can go here. Okay. He's got he's cast a spell on one of his troops, I think. Okay, there's uh, some big defense in this city. And there's the blue node. These are the ones we want. You can find really good things in these actually. Oh, was that a settler? Okay, Ariel. So, she's all white. As far as I remember. Yeah, oh. Not completely. She's got two red already. I think uh, these you will find in um, nodes. If you complete a red note, you have the chance of finding one of these. But two in this early in the game, that's quick. And she's Conjure. Uh, all summoning spells is reduced by 25% and reducing the uh, maintenance and f of fantastic creatures, which is also one of the, some of those you you uh, create, you summon. So we actually only need to find the last one. I'm not sure I would like to have these running around. Um so let's build this so uh, uh, library where it was so we can get a bit more oh <laughs> well i think we just <laughs> that wasn't actually supposed to happen okay i was lucky and okay they she's got uh, a big army already Okay. And let's try and see here where we should place our new city. Maximum population is 17. Production bonus, gold bonus. We'd want a big cap, but we also want good bonuses. So 17 isn't actually that bad. Um, and where is the, there's the nice shade down here, maximum population. But you can see there's there aren't actually much population down here. But okay, let's see. Okay, there's apparently a city up here. Uh, and there's another city in this vicinity. And also here. And this. Maximum population is actually quite low. Production bonus is high because of the mountains. And. I think we're gonna start to make this. Make it here. So we can get a maximum population of 17. And I'm going to have to make a worker here for the food. 
and change this one to uh we want we want stable so we can get some more so we are losing one gold a turn but we're gaining food and we'll go over here that is the white equivalent of a a, a bit stronger spirit that's got flight instead of uh, the magic spirit here who has water walking oh and that's why you should not just um, <laughs> choose the <laughs> player uh, pig here going out in the back we can't do this yeah while fleeing you lost one magic spirit we deserve that one <laughs> it was the capital it was her capital okay yeah so now we are actually at war because I accidentally attacked her but that was that's what happened I'm gonna end the recording here and let's see you in the next episode I'm just gonna save the game here yay happy and see you later bye